So I love using coloured pencils, but I'm not the best at using coloured pencils because I haven't practised enough at using coloured pencils. So I decided that I wanted to get a little bit better and just vary the techniques that I think to use when I'm colouring. So I bought myself this book to try. This is Pencil Workshop by Sasha Prude. She has also done watercolour workshop and marker workshop if those media are a bit more your bag but then it says at the top develop your sketching skills in 50 experiments and this is what I wanted it for it's a real chunky book as you can see and it is packed to the brim with all of these pages with prompts so that you can get ideas for how to colour in in different ways so using patterns and varying your patterns against each other, using um, gradients and merging your colours and yeah there are lots of different things in here with lots of areas for you to copy what's on this side and put your own things in but also extra areas so that you can create your own experiments which I think is quite a nice idea. This is the back of the book, so it says explore the possibilities of pencils, develop your pencil art skills and discover the limitless creative uses of graphite coloured and watercolour pencils. So obviously I'm not doing the entire book in one sitting. That would be madness because it's gigantic, but I did want to just do a couple of these with you just so that you can, I don't know, just come along on the mellow colouring journey with me. Yeah, it's just it's just going to be very calm, isn't it? <sighs> just to say, this book does have a bunch of information at the start of the book. If you're a super pencil beginner, then it goes through all the different kinds of pencils that you might come across and the kind of ways that you may start using the materials later on. So obviously when you're working through this book in your own time, like I will be doing, you can go from the beginning and just work through each page. But for the purposes of this video, just so that we're not doing the similar types of things for quite a long time, I'm going to just skip around a bit and just do a few which seem like they're fun. Yeah. So I'm going to start on this page just because this is one of, there's quite a few of these types of pages at the start of the book. So I'll only do a few on this page just to kind of, whoops, knocking things over. So I'm thinking of doing this one, which is in wax orange on this one, but I'm going to do it with a blue pencil just because why not? Because I like saying blue. This one is quite fun because it looks like it's three lines at a time but they are kind of interweaving with each other so that it looks as if they're all kind of connected up. I feel already like I need to have sharpened this. Let's just sharpen the pencil. Whoop, whoop, de whoop, boop de boop, doop de doop de doop. Bub dee bub dee bub. That's a little bit messy around that area, but it's okay. One, two, three. I'm getting a bit less carey. One, two, three. One, two, three. This is going to get super annoying me saying one, two, three all the time. Bing, bang, bong. Flip, flap, flop. Billy, dilly, silly. Cat, bat, hat. Mop, top, flop. Wing, ding, ping. <laughs> Probably an anti-climax for you, but um, that's 
felt like it took quite a long time. Right, I want to do something that isn't a square. So I'm going to try this leaf, but I think we're going to do pink and purple. Because why not? This purple, the light purple, a pink. Let's just get those ready to go. Shaving off bits of pencil. Ooh, pointy. Too pointy. Oh no. Don't you just hate that when it kills a bit of your doodad? Oh, the lead in this feels wobbly already. Stay together, lead. Line, 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 line. Oh. <laughs> That was like weirdly in time. I feel like this is going to take me ages, but it will look really nice when it's done. <laughs> Okay, this is where I'm up to so far and it's taking a long time so I don't think I'm gonna finish it on this video but I've done about a third of it and you can see it's I think it's gonna look really nice when it's done let's do um, another design just before we wrap this video up um, which one shall we do that one would take whatever I think I quite like this one and it is just lines, it looks like. Maybe we'll give this a go. Okay, and this is how far I have got with this one. I think it's a really nice technique. It looks really nice. So yeah, it will look good when it's finished, but it is lunchtime. I'm hungry. So I'm gonna end the video here. I think I'm really gonna enjoy completing this book and having lots of mellow zone out times with my pencils. Thanks so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it in some weird way, just watching some pencils noodling around on a page. If you did enjoy it, please do consider giving it a thumbs up. It really does help the channel. Let me know if you have tried any books like this to practice your skills in whatever medium, pencils or watercolors or markers. Yeah, let me know in the comments down below. And so yeah, I'm rambling now and um, I think we should probably stop. Have a good day and keep making happy. I'll see you next time. Woohoo!